Hull is the City of Culture 2017 uh, and I think it's a very nice link um, that we've formed uh, as a family uh, and as a community in, in Hull between England and India. Um, I don't think that many people are aware of the number of cricketers in particular that have been through Hull, but we're probably looking at at least around 20 cricketers, uh, right from 1990 when Dilip Vengsaka came over to W.V. Raman, uh, to more recently we've had Safaraz Khan, Prithvi Shaw, Vikas Dixit and a few others. Um, and we've got an ongoing tie-up now with the Andhra state, so we'll be, Hull will be seeing a lot more cricketers in the future. Uh, and I think it's been a wonderful uh, link, the cricket and the medicine, between Hull, England and India. I think both medicine, um, because of the number of doctors that have come over from uh, the Indian subcontinent, I think almost 30 to 40% of the current workforce in the NHS are either um, first generation um, or second generation doctors of that gener not just doctors actually, but nurses and other healthcare professionals. So I think there is a definite bond between India and England in terms of health, and also cricket is, is uh, certainly ties the two nations together as well. I think despite Brexit, actually, the, the relationship was moving from strength to strength, and I think it will continue to move from strength to strength. Perhaps Brexit may just make the link between India and England more important.